Hey, up next on the Marmy Rock Show. Man, I just looked back and realized it's been over a year since we had Dorian Gates from Ghost Season on the show. They're a fantastic band that you need to hear out of Athens, Greece. Uh, Dorian, welcome back to the show and Happy New Year, man. Thanks a lot, guys. Thanks for everything. Happy New Year. I hope you all uh, had a wonderful time in your holidays, vacations, whatever. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Hey, so, yeah, man, it's been a year since I talked to you, and a lot's been going on, but just real quick, how did you guys ring in the new year? Were you playing a gig, or were you just celebrating? No, no, we're just celebrating because, you know, we're not playing any gigs. We're not having any gigs now because it's, uh, you know, we're on the recording uh, uh, phase here, and, uh, you know, we're in the studio, a lot of work, man, like work, 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 recording. You know, we changed uh, a couple of members, so we had to, you know, uh, you know, to do some stuff from the beginning and, you know, work. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, since it's been a little while, give us an update. Who are some of the new members in the band? Introduce them to us. Yeah, uh, our new singer is uh, he's called uh, Hercules Zotos. Uh, his previous band was uh, XIX. I don't know if you have any idea. Uh, they were kind of a heavy, heavy metal-ish kind of band. Really cool band. He's a really cool guy, and uh, the second member is the, our new drummer. Uh, he's, uh, his name is Ross L. So uh, he was playing again in a heavy metal band, like power metal kind of band. Yeah. But, uh, you know, he fits very well in the, in the whole, you know, music uh, style that we, that we play. So, you know, we're pretty happy with them, you know. They're amazing guys, you know. Yeah, so I, I noticed, so the new singles out, Break My Chains, and it's interesting, I was going to ask you about what, what the new members bring to the lineup, because it does have a little bit of a different sound than some of the tunes on Ghost, uh, Ghost Like Her, doesn't it? Yeah, it's a little bit more, more moody, let's say, or something, something like this, you mean, yeah. <laughs> uh, you know, they, they brought their own influences, you know, they brought their own, uh, for example, uh, our singer, uh, uh, Hercules, he's he sings more of a kind of a heavy metal. He's coming from a more heavy metal background, you know, like a old school kind of metal, you know, Iron Maiden and you know Saxon um, Sanctuary and all this kind of stuff. So he brought his own uh, musical influence in the in the in the band. I think if it's really well, you know, I think if it's really really cool with the band, I don't know, you know. Uh, our drummer Ross, uh, you know, we always, we always wanted a guy who knows how to play like uh, fast drums and you know uh, play the double uh, the double pedal. How do you call it in English? My yeah, English are a, a little bit rusty. <laughs> no, no, that's fine. Yeah, double pedal bass, that's good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So we always wanted a guy who knew how to play uh, this thing fast, you know. So he's uh, he's the excellent guy for the work, you know, for the job. So, uh, you know, they brought their own influences and their own uh, characters. Uh, th th their characters are really good for the, for the whole vibe of the band, you know. <laughs> so uh, you mentioned Break My Chains. It's out there now as a single here in the U.S., and it's part of an upcoming album. Tell us a little bit. Are you going to be releasing other singles before the album comes out, or is it going to be this, just this one before the album? Uh, probably we will release uh, one more single in the coming month or, say, or something like it, it, maybe in a couple of months you know I'm not sure uh, but you know we're still uh, recording the whole album because you know we had the you know two three of our mem basic members you know left the band for their own purposes or something uh, you know we, we started recording from the beginning and you know we had some time uh, uh, we stayed back a little bit, you know, until we find the new members, until we find the singer, the drummer. Uh, you know, we stayed, you know, we stayed back a little bit. So, uh, so this uh, single and probably one more uh, will be the how do you call it in English? The pre, pre the pre, uh, like pre-release, pre-release, yeah, of the new album, you know. Which uh, is probably be released in uh, springtime or something, somewhere like somewhere there. We'll look. We'll look forward to that for sure. Now, um, <laughs> hey, I noticed something pretty cool. You guys did. You have a new uh, Android app out for the Ghost season. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell people a little bit about the app. Yeah, it's a. Uh, uh, 
how I call it, uh, an everything goes season kind of app, you know, <laughs> which, you know, it's free, of course, and uh, you can download it from uh, our Facebook page, you know, if you check the, the tabs out there, you know, that says about photos and uh, music and all this stuff, you know, if you press it and go down, you'll see something, it's a little tab that writes ghost app, so uh, it's an everything goes season app that, you know, contains uh you know, a video clip of the band. It has a it has a mini quiz game inside that I made myself. You know? <laughs> yeah, I made how to do ups, how to make ups. You know, we do everything ourselves here. You know, so uh, it's a pretty sweet little app. You know, uh, it has this game inside. It has uh, live videos from YouTube. It has uh, the bio of the band, contact. Uh, plus, it has a. Uh, you know, we're giving uh, like a gift to the to the fans. Let's say uh, three uh, books, like with ghost stories in it. Oh, cool! Oh, so, yeah, it's really big books, man. So you know, you can read in your spare time or something. It's really cool. You know, it's a sweet little app that uh, whoever you know likes the band a lot who have the app. You know, he can go and uh, uh, download it for free. You know, it's really cool. It's really we'll cool. tell. Make sure folks get out there and check that out. Hey, when I looked at your page, I saw there's like a symbol or a seal there that looks like a, two eagles with some arrows. Can you tell me about that symbol? Uh, it's something, it's not something uh, that important. You know, it's something that I made in my spare time, you know. Now, and, uh, you know, when I had spare time uh, off work or something, uh, I just suddenly made something like something I liked or something. You know, and, you know, it's, it's a pretty simple uh symbol or something you know our main symbol is the gs you know with something like a cross in the middle i don't know if you have ever seen it yeah i saw it. it's like a you have like a key ring or something out there with it right yeah it's, it's like a key chain or uh, how do you call it uh key ring yeah this thing <laughs> <laughs> uh yeah it's pretty cool it's not the symbol of the band this uh twin eagle kind of stuff but uh it's something that i thought it would be really cool for a like a stamp or something. I don't know, you know. It's nice and, you know, I don't know if we can use it somewhere. Probably for a t-shirt or something. It would be cool, I think. You like it? Yeah, it looked pretty cool. Hey, it caught my attention enough to have me ask you about it, so... I don't know, probably we'll make it in a t-shirt or something. <laughs> hey, uh, so you mentioned uh, that you guys are, like, really entrenched in the studio right now. Is there a timeline for when people can see you live again? Have you thought about when that might be? We want to play live, uh, we want to have gigs and stuff, but, you know, our main focus now, it's, I think, is, is on the album, you know. We have a lot, of, a lot of work still, you know, because as I told you, you know, we have, like, uh, these members that we have now are pretty new, you know. We found our singer in uh, September, I think, uh, you know, we need a little bit of work with the new members that we have now to go out and play live and be perfect, you know? You know, we will go out, like, but probably uh, from uh, March, after March or something, you know, because we, we really need to focus in the, in the, in the recording night right now, you know? Now, are you going to still mix in some of the older tunes from the Ghost Like Her album when you guys play live? Are they still going to be a part of the set? Yeah, yeah, they will be part of the set. I don't know how they will come out with the new members, but I think... Uh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna be cool, I think. But yeah, all the the first EP, uh, Ghost Like Harry B, will be in the in the live show. Well, that's so, good. That's good to hear because I don't want to see those songs go away, man. It's a great release from you guys, and I'm looking forward to the new stuff too. Thanks, Lon, man. Thanks <laughs> I'll probably send you some stuff uh, before we release the. The record, so. uh, we'll spend it for sure on the show. Now, um, hey, I see like uh, you know a lot of shows like mine. You guys are gaining some traction here in the U.S. Do you see the next big expansion of your band to be here in the U.S. or is it going to be in another part of the world, like maybe somewhere in Europe? Uh, look, the U.S. is something. Uh, it's something difficult for a for a Greek band, for a European band, and a small band like we are. You know, we really wish we could make it in the U.S. like tomorrow, man. You know, <laughs> <laughs> it would be pretty awesome even with the uh, little songs that we have out now, you know, but uh, it's a little bit difficult, but we wish we find a way to come to the U.S. I mean, it's really, 
amazing in the U.S. You know, the whole uh, modern metal genres that you have there and the whole, like, a uh, mixture of, uh, of styles and stuff. Yeah. You know, and, you know, always re- I always... And I always remember that, you know, in the U.S. it's the the style that we play now, the alternative metal kind of style. It's uh, in the U.S. has a big uh, a big base, you know. So uh, it's, it's pretty cool, you know. We wish we could come, like, tomorrow, but it's, uh, it's a little <laughs> bit difficult for now, you know. We don't have the material still to come, you know. So do you think you'll expand, uh, even if it's not here in the U.S., do you have plans to uh, play outside of uh, Greece at all in the upcoming year? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have plans. Actually, we have big plans, to tell the truth. But uh, we must find uh, we must find like bands to gig with. You know, we cannot go out outside. You know, ourselves because you know, as I told you, we're a new band, and uh, we need the experience of uh, going out outside Greece, outside of our country, and you know, play live in a crowd that we don't even. You know, we must be known. You know all this stuff that uh, will uh, allow us to go outside from uh, outside of Greece and play. You know we had we haven't done you know too too many lives in Greece. You know uh, for starters, you know to to act to make a big step for outside Greece. You know so it's a little bit. It will come. It will come. But it will be a little bit like not now. You know right. A little bit down the road. I get it, man. So. <laughs> but it's the plans. I mean for sure. <laughs> Um, so, hey, uh, listen, we look forward to seeing everything that comes out on the new record, and um, I want to tell folks now to go out there and pick up Break My Change. They can pick that one up right now, and, uh, you know, Dory mentioned a new single probably coming out soon, so, um, hey, yeah. congratulations on the release of the single, and it's always good talking to you, man. I appreciate you coming back yeah. on the show. Thanks a lot, man. And remember, you know, the previous interview we had, the first one, was the first interview I've ever done in a radio station outside Greece. Hey, man, we'll we'll wear that like a badge of honor, man. We love bringing new music to the folks here. I remember I was so nervous. I was like, what the hell, man? You know, what the hell am I doing here? (laughs) Well, no need to be... Yeah, no need to ever be nervous with us, man. You guys are a great band, and uh, we're going to keep our eyes on you guys for sure. Thanks a lot, man. Thanks a lot for everything and for this interview and for, you know, promoting the band as you as you can promote the band. I mean, thanks a lot for everything. I don't have any words to say. 